Oh, wake up. This is your wake up call, known as Charlie. Go get him, Grace. This is how we wake up at the Crump House. Get him, Charlie. Get him, Charlie. Get him, Charlie. <laughs> Why is he so excited? He <laughs> loves you. Oh, all right, come on, down. Hi there. Um, today we're going over the super stunt model that we're doing now. This one's for Liam Turner here from the UK. Um, as you can see, he's a grown. Uh, he usually rides about a 5'6", five, 5'7", five, seven, about 17, 17 and 8th wide, 2-ish sort of board with a fair bit of rocker. This board is designed to, so he can ride it in minuscule waves that he gets at home in the UK or here or in France. Um, it's a small, uh, like a junior version of our super stunt model. It's quite a low rocker, um, quite a bit of area in the tail, and a bit of thickness through the middle. Still a nice, you know, low, sexy rail. A little bit of a double concave here with a tiny bit of V off the tail. Um, they're designed just to go get up and go in super fast and small gutless waves, so a kid like him can be up and go in Mach 10 by second pump, and then still nice and thin through the tail. So you can, so they'll pop and get up into the air real easy. Um, not really designed to ride it over two or three foot surf because, as you can see, the rocker is quite low in it, but it's foiled out and thin through the tail. Um, this one would measure up at 5'3", 17 and a half, 2 and a sixteenth. So three to four inches shorter. This, since he's probably about three quarters of an inch wider and about, uh, it's two and a sixteenth, about a sixteenth inch thicker than he normally rides. Um, this one we're going to show us show the design on the computer and show him surfing on in the next few days.